Me and nine other noobs are gonna spend the next five days racing to max level. Whoever wins gets 20,000 Robux. Everybody go. Go, 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 go. Time is of the essence. Wait, hold on, hold on. Let me get this. No, no, no. My God, there's not enough bandits to go around. Yeah, come on. All right, this is impossible. I'm going to another server. All right, I just joined another server. That was way too hectic. And uh, like I said, guys, I am also participating. So I gotta get serious because those guys I'm competing with are not actual noobs. They're very pro just with all the counts. So this is gonna be real tough. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Hit him with the M1 spam. The classic. Let's go, baby. So while I'm grinding, let me just explain the rules real quick. At the end of the five days, whoever has the highest level gets the 20,000 Robux, but I'm not going to make it easy. I'm going to be introducing a brand new challenge every single day to make this race interesting. And on day number one, we're not allowed to use any Devil Fruits, Game Passes, or Double XP. They've given me the login information to these accounts, and I will be logging in every day to check the progress. And look at that. I'm already level 33. I'm going to win this. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be grinding non-stop for the next five days i also have to take poop breaks so that's it that's the only break i'm taking when i take a sh just kidding but yeah let's see how much progress i can make in the next day and also how much progress those other nerds make i'll see y'all back in like 24 hours all right, everybody, it's been an entire day. We are now at day two, and these guys don't know, but I'm about to log into each one of their accounts to check their progress and make sure that they're not cheating. Starting with Korra. All right, this dude is in the second C? What the hell? How is he in the second C, bro? He has no double XP on. We confirmed that none of the double XP codes have been used on this account. No fruits. He does have the... <laughs> 295 mastery? He put all his stats on melee. How's he been surviving? First account, Korra, I'm assuming is in the lead. If this guy is not in first place, then it's gonna be very concerning. I wish these guys are going outside and taking breaks. All right, uh, we're now checking in Blaze's account. Let's take a look at his progress. It looks like he's still in the first C, so definitely not 700 yet. That is actually much more normal. So he got the dark step fighting style. No double XP, no fruit. 225, very respectable, Blaze. All right, we're on Dai's account. He is, uh... <laughs> How are they doing? I'm embarrassed to show my level. My man is almost 500. No fruit, no double XP used. These guys are insane. I'm gonna hire them to grind my old account. By the way, guys, only I know these guys' login information. They don't know each other, so they're in suspense as to what level their competition is. Currently on Fuguru's account, he is level 472. Very close to dice. My man's got the slingshot, dude. <laughs> what stats he got on? Melee and defense. These are all very impressive. Remember, we're only on the first day. All right, now we're on to PP. Bro, you're your name is PP, bro. I can't believe you just made me say that. Level 200. Oh, God. All right. Thank you. Finally, somebody normal again. All right. We got water kung fu. Still no fruits. Where all your money go? What the hell? How do you have no money? All right. Next up, we got hyper. Okay. Another normal human being that understands the concept of touching grass. Pretty good. We got the dark step. Excellent. And he got all his stats on melee as well. Zero defense. How do you guys do it without adding defense? I don't understand. I keep dying. All right. We're now on Null's account. Let's check this out. 275. Okay. Okay. The bottom couple of guys are all very close, around the level 200 range. So all he got is water kung fu, not even a sword. All stats on melee. All right, no. Very nice. Okay, I don't know what I'm reading. Is that exit? <laughs> We have Voids. Also in the first C, level 108. Oh, that makes me feel so much better. Although, uh, spoilers alert, I'm still in last place. Last but not least, we're on Rico's account. Yo, these guys are all sick. How are they all doing this? Level 455, no double XP, no fruit. Still on combat too. My man didn't even bother buying a fighting style. He got his stats on sword. All right, he's going with the sword main. Guys, I really, really don't want to show y'all my account after all this. All right, everybody, I am now loading into my account. You are in for a very special treat. I am level. 84. I got combat. Hey, at least I got all the skills unlocked for combat. I am currently dead last. You know the saying, if you ain't first, you're last. So, you know, it makes no difference. These guys are all better at grinding than I am. So guys, I took a very, very long poop break. All right, it lasted 23 hours. And so I only had one hour to grind. All right, we're now about to bring everybody into the server to get ready for day two, where we're able to spin for a random fruit at the gacha to help with the grind. All right, looking down the list, everybody, I am clearly last place. Everybody can tell. Everybody's shocked that Fulguru is having 1.4 million honor. Wait till they see Korra. All right, we got the whole squad in the server right now. Going from left to right, I'm just gonna let everybody say their levels. Just so they know where they are among their competition and they know where to catch up. All right, Fufu, 482, 455, 504. This guy's a maniac. Boys is 108. Hyper is 105. PP is 200. No is 275. Blaze is 225. I'm 84. I hate to admit it. Cheater. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start. I can't wait. Line up behind me. So we're gonna spin for fruit and we're gonna be using that to help us grind for day number two here we go yes yes let's go oh my god the comeback is gonna be real guys <laughs> 
PB got no money, you fools. What did Hyper get? Rubber. Ah, oh, bro. Sucks for you, man. Blaze got the spring. No way. Bufu got the rocket. Cora got the chop. All right, that works in everybody's favor because the dude is in the lead right now. Oh, y'all, luck is trash. Die. What'd you get? Oh, that's a good one. Die might make a comeback. All right, I'm going to eat my fruit. Y'all go eat yours. So the only person that was left that didn't spin for a fruit was no, but he has told me that he's not going to use a fruit anyway. Straight up melee. And we're also allowed to use double XP now, so that's going to help a lot. I might make a comeback after this, boy. Let's do it. See you back at day three. All right, guys, we just hit day three. And after two whole days of intense, painful, nonstop grinding, I'm sure the level difference between these guys are gonna be much higher now. And that's why I've implemented a brand new point system. And it is no longer whomever has the highest level, but whomever has the highest points at the end of the five days wins the challenge. Maybe that'll motivate some of these stragglers to catch up, but let's check their levels. Bro, ain't no way this dude Korra is already in the third seat. Bro, ain't no way this guy is level 2050, bro. With the chop? How is that even possible? This is very concerning. We need to call Cora's parents. We're currently looking at Dai's account. Oh, he made another decent amount of progress, but also he's still playing as if he's a human being. He's not even using the fruit. What are you up to, Dai? Straight up melee and defense. I respect it. All right, Blaze is... Has this guy made any progress at all? What I feel like he's the same level as he was yesterday. <laughs> level 283. All right, okay. I mean, it's nothing to laugh at, but uh, you're falling really far behind, Blaze. We're looking at food gurus. This dude's almost max level with the rocket. He's got race awakening? No, okay, that's V3. How's he doing this with a rocket fruit? Max stats on melee, defense, and fruit? How is this possible? Some shenanigans is going on out here, bro. There's just ain't no way. We're on the third day. Guys, in the comments, if you're a master speedrun grinder, let me know in the comments if this is possible because I'm uh, very skeptical. All right, Rico also made his way over to the second C. What are we at? Level 708. Fresh to the second C. Looks like he's decided to not use the fruit that he spun for at all. I forgot which one it even was. Must have not been very good. I'll say that. All right, we're looking at EP now. Why do I feel like he's at the same spot as he was yesterday? I think this man has given up on the challenge completely. All right, Voids also made absolutely no progress, probably, from the day before. Got the bomb fruit, 127 mastery. My man's actually using the fruit. Good stuff, Void. I respect that. I am no longer at last place. Having that life fruit really helped me a tremendous amount. All right, we're looking at Hyper's account, day number three. He's at Magma Village. I think he probably did make some progress. My man doesn't even have flash that. Do you even have hockey? Okay, he has hockey. All right, last but not least, we have Null, level 275. Again, no progress. I think many of them have pretty much given up on the challenge, seeing how far ahead Fufu and Korra are pretty much. So to keep the second half of the challenge interesting, being max level is no longer enough. We're adding more challenges for the contestants to compete for the prize. Here's the list. Being max level, three points. Race Awakening, three points. Mythical Sword, one point each. Soul Guitar, one point. Unlocking Fighting Styles, one point each. Here it is up on the screen. Now uh, You guys can pause the video to take a look. Whoever has the most points at the end of the five days wins. Now the invited all of these guys into the server and they can have anything they want from the shop that they think will help them with the grind, except for permanent fruits. EP's up first, two times XP. There you go, EP. Alright, Korra. Two times mastery. Oh, okay. I wonder what he's gonna need the two times mastery for. That's an interesting strategy. Next, Void Dark Blade. What the hell? Oh, okay. If you think that'll help, there's the Dark Blade. No. You want the Dark Blade too? Wait, what? What's going on? This is not even any good. Hyper wants the Yoru. Fufu is asking, why is everyone asking for the Yoru? Hey, that's a great question. I also want to know. Rico, you're up. 24 hours of double XP. That one makes much more sense. Fufu also wants two times mastery. Okay, these guys have something up their sleeve. I wonder what it is. If you guys can figure out what these guys' strategies are for the game passes that they're choosing, do let me know. Lays! <laughs> Okay, it's a competition for the two times mastery. Last but not least, does Yoru count as a mythical sword for a point? That's a great question. No, it doesn't. Instead, Dai wants 24 hours of double XP, so there you go. Oh, by the way, guys, they're now also allowed to change to any fruit that they want. So good luck with the grind. Day four, and yes, I finally changed my hoodie, so I'm not as dirty as you guys thought. So great news, I've decided that some of the people are following just way too far behind, uh, including myself. So I'm gonna be eliminating the bottom six contestants, so only the top four remains. All right, we're starting off with Korra's account. This guy is 2403, pretty much, uh, yeah, almost max level. He's got Ming V3, but hasn't gotten the V4 yet. Looks like he's trying to collect the true triple katana. He got the Sadi, Wando, and the Shisui. He has not mastered the events observation hockey. 
but he does have full body aura. All right, now let's check out his hockey colors. Also has a legendary hockey color. That earns him another point. We're gonna have to go to the third seed to see how many fighting styles he's got. So he got the dragon breath, got the superhuman, got sharkman karate. So obviously he has fishman karate. Electric fighting style, dark step, death step, electric claw. Okay. Does he have god human? Ah, no god human yet. Okay, all right. So based on everything Korra has unlocked, I believe he's sitting at 11 points. All right, we're now on dice alt for full disclosure. Uh, for some reason, dice account got banned. So we're using another alt of his, which is very similar level uh, to what he had before. Does not have any of the mythical swords or the soul guitar. Does not have any of the legendary hockey colors. Does not even have observation hockey, not to mention advanced observation hockey. Uh, he does have full body hockey though. So that's one point. Also, he's still on combat. So obviously he has no other fighting style. So Dai is sitting at a very comfortable one point at day four. Now we're on Fufu's account. Let's see. Oh, this guy's probably max level. Yep, there it is. Pfft. How are you doing this? So he does have the awakening as well. He has the cursed dual katana. He has the soul guitar. He's got advanced observation hockey, full body armament hockey. Let's go check out his fighting styles. God human. So wait, the fact that he has God human tells me he has all of these fighting styles already. How is he doing this? But does he have the sanguine art? I'm not even gonna go all the way to Tiki to find out. I'm just gonna assume he doesn't. I think he'll still be in the lead anyway. That puts Fufu at currently 20 points. All right, next up we got Rico. He just made it over to the second C. I'm gonna also safely assume that my man Rico currently has zero points. I'm not even gonna diss because I'll be honest with you, he's made more progress than I have. So, all right, now we're looking at EP's account. I guess he has the water kung fu, so that's one point. One point ain't gonna be enough to win, so it doesn't matter. All right, now we're on Blaze's account. It looks like he's still in the first C. Not much progress was made. He does have dark step fighting style, so I guess we'll give him one point for that. Next up, we got Voids. All right, he made his way over to the third C. That's great, but great use to my Yoru. Otherwise, I'd be upset. His arm is sticking out of the back of his coat. So what does he have? I believe he only has one fighting style. That is the dark step. No advanced observation hockey. He does have full body hockey. So that's another point. So with all that said, Voice is currently sitting at a breezy two points. All right, we're back on Hyper's account. Why do I feel like this man has not moved since the last three days? I think he probably made the most progress in the first day. He's got water kung fu, but I'm pretty sure nothing else. So Hyper pretty much out of the race with one point. All right, uh, we got Null coming next. He made it to the second C. Very good. He's got the water kung fu. So right off the bat, that's one point. And he has nothing else. So one point for Noel. And I'm sure you guys are all dying to wait and see how much progress and you have you made in the last day. And the answer is not much. <laughs> I'm not much better than these guys. I don't even have a fighting style to be honest. So I think I'm last place with zero points. I don't have a store fruit. I don't have anything, bro. So for our remaining four contestants, I'm gonna give them whatever fruit they want to help them with the rest of the grind. So the top four players that are still in the race are Korra, Dai, Voids, and I hate to say it, Fulgurus. So everybody else has been eliminated, including myself. So Korra has claimed uh, the portal fruit for some reason. Maybe he wants to travel around faster to unlock uh, stuff. So Fufu, which is Fulgurus, he wants the Buddha. There you go, buddy. All right, so next up, we got Voids. He wants the Kitsune fruit. So he better have something to trade with me because I'm not trying to give away a perm. Let's hope that's enough. How do you get the pain? Damn, the Kitsune is worth eight. No, four 41%? Please tell me you have something better. That is crazy, man. So we managed to shift some trades around. He should have enough for the Kitsune now. Okay, perfect. Better use this to win, Voids. This is my most expensive fruit. All right, next up, we got Dai in the server. What fruit do you want, buddy? Hmm. Let me think. Rumble? Okay, why? I need to know. Logia need AFK mastery. Okay, you know what? That's a great reason. So now all of the players have been awarded the fruit that they want to continue to grind for day four. Let's check back in in a day. Ladies and gentlemen, the time is up. We're now at the end of day five and let's take a look at the progress, starting with Korra. So let's just go down the list here. Max level, check. Race Awakening, check. Mythical Swords, he got two. Surprised he didn't get the Hollow Essence. Mythical Gun, he's got it. He's got the God Human, which means he has all the other basic fighting styles, but does he have Sanguine Art? And he does not have Sanguine Art. Okay, every single fighting style except the Sanguine Art. Looks like he's decided not to unlock Instinct V2, but he does have full body high 
Kentucky, as well as the three legendary colors. All right, last thing to check here, three Leviathan hearts. That's another three points. So Cora ends the contest with 26. All right, now we're on Dai's account. My man has not reached the max level. He has not gotten a race awakening. He does not have a single mythical sword or gun. I don't think there's a point checking his fighting styles. My dude is out. It's definitely gonna come down between Korra and Fugaroos or Fufu. Alright, next up, for reasons unknown, uh, Void's got just, he got banned uh, over the last day, so he's been disqualified from the contest. He just can't catch up. Alright, last but not least, we're on Fugaroos' account. Let's take a look here. Max level, check. Race Awakening, check. The mythical gun, two mythical swords. Also didn't get the Hollow Essence. Is it that hard to get? He's got God Human, but does he have Sanguine Art? Before we go all the way to Tiki to check, uh, let's just check everything else he has. So he has full body aura. He has all three legendary colors. No advanced instinct yet again. And I'm pretty sure we just spotted a hacker. Can y'all tell me what this is? What's happening here? And he has one Leviathan heart. So that means even if he does have Sanguine Art fighting style, he will still be one point away from beating Korra. That makes Korra the winner. My man actually made a comeback. What an intense battle, everybody. Congratulations to Korra on the epic comeback and also Fufu. I mean, y'all went crazy. <laughs> I would not have made this much progress even if I tried. So, uh, huge congratulations to Korra for being a complete nerd and a total no life. Uh, he's gonna receive this 20,000 Robux worth of gift card. And for his valiant efforts and coming in second place, honestly, Fufu put up an epic performance. So, I decided to throw him 5,000 Robux as well. Shout out to all the participants in this challenge. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.